Here the question is six points x i y i are taken on a circle x square plus y square equals to four such that summation x i is equal to eight and summation y i is equal to four. The line segment joining ortho center of the triangle made by any three points and the centroid of triangle made by other three points pass through a fixed point h k then h plus k is. So we have this circle with center at origin and then we have six points on this circle say a b c and p q r now suppose a is x1 y1 b is x2 y2 and c is x3 y3 and this PQR is suppose x4 y4 x5 y5 and x6 y6 now center of triangle made by other three points suppose other three points are PQR then center of this triangle made by PQR will be this x4 plus x5 plus x6 by 3 and y4 plus y5 plus y6 by 3. Now centroid of this triangle, suppose this is centroid of second, centroid of first triangle it is x1 plus x2 plus x3 by 3 and y1 plus y2 plus y3 by 3. Circumcenter for this triangle it is at origin. So, circumcenter it is at 0, 0 and we know that O, G and H they are collinear and G divides O, H in the ratio 1 is to 2. Now, this is 0, 0. This is summation X, I by 3 and summation Y, I by 3 where I takes the value 1, 2 and 3. Now using suction formula, we can find coordinate of this point H and that will be x1 plus x2 plus x3 comma y1 plus y2 plus y3. Now it says a line segment joining ortho center of the triangle made by n3 points and center of the triangle made by other three points pass through a fixed point HK. Then we have to find the value of H plus K. Now ortho center is this point and suppose this is alpha and this is beta so we'll say this ortho center is at alpha beta and centroid of the triangle it is g2 and it is x4 plus x5 plus x6 now we know that summation xi it is equal to 8 and x1 plus x2 plus x3 is equal to alpha so this g2 it will be 8 minus alpha by 3 and in the same way summation yi it is given as 4 so y4 plus y5 plus y6 will be 4 minus beta upon 3 now any line passing through gh it will pass through a fixed point and we have to find that fixed point now that point it should be independent of alpha and beta and we know that if we multiply it with 3 and this with 1, then alpha and beta they'll cancel. So we'll look for a point which will divide it in the ratio 3 is to 1. Now coordinate of that point will be 8 minus alpha plus alpha upon 4 and here will be 4 minus beta plus beta upon 4. So this point will be 2 comma 1. So in this case, value of h is 2 and value of k is 1. And we are looking for value of h plus k and the value of h plus k is simply 3 and that is the answer to this question.